Hi class uh, 3 students, I hope you all are keeping well and you are all set to go for your classes, right? So uh, welcome to this uh, academic session of 2020-21 where I am going to take your abacus class, okay? So uh, like because this is the first uh, class or session, let me just revise the class whatever you have done in the previous class, in class 2. Hmm. And then next class when again I will come that day I will teach you the main uh, formulas uh, which are there for this semester okay so let's begin uh, what we have learned we will see first of all let me write the subject name abacus and this is for class 3 so before I begin Keep yourself ready uh, with one rough copy and one pencil with you, okay? And then we will begin the class, okay? Now, last class, what we have seen, we have done small friend formula. If I am not wrong, you all remember small friend formula plus and minus both the formulas, right? So, when we were doing plus formulas means small friend plus when we were doing what we have seen that common friend is 5 right and then the best friends 4 best friend was 1 1 best friend was 4 3's best friend was 2 2's best friend was 3 right and how we used to write the formulas we know that Small friend formula always starts with plus sign. Hmm? So, if I write like this, plus 4 equal to, what is the process? It will start with plus sign. And who will be at the beginning? Best friend or common friend? Common friend. So, plus 5 minus 1. Then we see plus 3. Same, my common friend is in the beginning and then my best friend. Then we come to plus 2. Common friend at first, then my best friend. And the last one, common friend first, then my best friend. Done? Now, this is one's place formula. This is the main formula. Then we have the extension. Say 10's place, 100's place, 1000's place. So we have already learned in 10's place how we are going to do. Just add up zeros. So the common friend is now 50, not 5. And how we are doing the formulas? Plus 40 is equal to plus 50 minus 10. Plus 30 equals to plus 50 minus 20. Plus 20 equals to plus 50 minus 30. Plus 10 equals to plus 5 minus 40. This is the basic formula of small friend. Clear? Then, when we talk about small friend minus formula, subtraction, that also you have done in the second semester. This was in the first semester. And in the second semester, what you have done? Subtraction. Subtraction also, who is the common friend? Common friend remains the same. 5. Right? And the formula again starts with plus sign only. We are not using minus sign. We are using plus sign only. Now here, if I want minus 4, what am I going to do? My plus 1 minus 5. Minus 5. 5 goes that side. That means best friend comes this side. Common friend goes that side. Right? Then minus 3. That means plus 2 minus 5. Minus 2. Plus 3 minus 5. I'm pretty sure you people are repeating there. Right? Please repeat after me. Okay? As I say, you also repeat after me. And... Minus 1 equal to plus 4 minus 5. Now same goes for 10 space. What we are doing? We are just adding 0. Hmm? Minus 40 equal to plus 10 minus 50. Minus 30 equal to plus 20 minus 50. Minus 20 equal to plus 30 minus 50. Uh, minus 10 equal to plus 40 minus 50. Simple. Now... We have learned from here that in small friend formula, both plus and minus 
together. How many formulas are there? This side 4, this side 4. Never count 10's place because 10's place, 100's place, 1000's place, these are all extension. But main formula which we are getting, it is here. Okay? So 4 here, 4 here is equal to 8 total small friend formula. Clear? Now, this is in uh, pen and paper we understood. How we do it? Let's see. You people sit straight. Whoever is uh, in front of this uh, uh, YouTube, please sit straight. And let me see how you people are doing it. Mm, first we will do finger gym. Show me finger gym. We sit like, we, uh, we stand like this or we sit like this. I need to turn this side. Okay. Now, one place, which hand? Right hand. Ten place, which hand? Left hand. So, this is one. This is two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So, my right hand says from one to nine. And what my left hand says? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Sorry, 80, 90. Done? So, this hand says from 10 to 90. Total right hand plus left hand gives me what answer? 90, 99, 99. This side 10's place, this side 1's place. Never get a confusion regarding this, okay? Right hand is always for your 1's place. Left hand is always for your 10's place. Clear? And when we make a fist like this, that means the answer is 0. Right? Clear? Now, if I say formulas, if I say 2 plus 2 means plus 2. Plus 1, what is the formula? Plus 5 minus 4. What is the answer? 5. Done. Now if I say clear abacus. Now 2 plus 2 plus 2. What is the formula? It's not possible direct. What is the formula? Plus 2 plus 5 minus 3. What is the answer? 6. Clear abacus. Then if I say 3 plus 3. Possible? Direct. I don't have any option. So what I will do? Plus 5 minus 2. Answer? 6. Clear? Again clear up because now if I say 4 plus 1. Is it possible? Plus 1? I don't have. Direct. So what is the process? Plus 5 minus 1. So the answer is 8. Clear? So in this way we do finger gym. Hmm? Now if I say come to visualization. I think you people have done visualization also in the last class. So if we are doing visualization. How we are going to do visualization? Tell me what is the process? How we sit in visualization? We hold our scale. I need to turn this way. Okay. We hold our scale like this. Hmm? Two fingers like this. And these two fingers we are holding the scale. With this finger also we are holding the scale. This hand we are supposed to keep. Just a minute. We are supposed to keep this pencil facing this side, not this side. This is wrong, dear. Keep in mind, this is wrong. You are not supposed to keep this side, okay? You will keep it this side. Done. Now holding the scale, fingers like this. Done. Now if you are doing the calculation, you need to use these two fingers. Because index finger will help you to calculate the upper bead and lower bead minus. And thumb will help you to add in the lower beads. Now visualize your scale in your mind. Right? You have to visualize your scale in your mind. Close your eyes. And then you will do the calculation. See, I have closed my eyes. Now how am I, how am I going to do it? If I say 2, I did. Again 2, I did. Now if I say 2 again, is it possible? No. Direct it is not possible. Then what is the formula? Plus 5 minus... 3. I get my answer. What is the answer? 6. Clear abacus. What is the process from right to left? You will never do clear abacus this way. It is always this side. Right to left. Hold your scale proper. Uh, sorry. Think your scale in your mind. 
visualize the scale properly okay done clear now if i give you the sum let me see how many of you can understand let's start 2 plus 2 plus 2 answer 6 right how we did we have used the small friend formula same goes with tens place 10 10 now plus 30 How you will do? It is not possible. Twenty is visible. So plus fifty minus twenty. Answer is fifty. So in this way we do small friend that uh, small friend addition and subtraction both. Subtraction. What is the process? It's just opposite. Ulta, right? What we do? We have to add best friend minus common friend. So common friend will be like this always, right? Now add suppose two minus five. That means I have added three. Suppose I do uh, plus. This is open plus three minus five. So I have added three extra three in this way. If I don't have any option in my fingers, then I have to do it in this way. If I don't have any option in my scale, I have to do it in this way. So this much is clear. I hope you all know the shape of abacus scale is rectangle. And wait a minute. If this is the abacus scale, just a revision. If this is the abacus scale, what we are going to do? We are going to take how many rods? Thirteen rods, right? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Done. What is this called? I forgot. Who can tell me? But I cannot hear you. What is this called? This is called. Unit bar, right? Now these are called unit dot. See, leaving two two, you need to put this dot. It's so congested that I cannot make out. Anyway, so this way we will start doing it, right? Unit dot. Now upper one is called heaven be dot. Upper bead. Lower one is called earth bead or lower bead. these beads are called uh, sorry these rods are called rods and these are called beads since i don't have space here you will see always there are four beads in the lower part and in upper part it is one right but what is the value if i ask you lower bead each bead is having one value is one but upper bead each bead you will get five value is five So it co continues in the same way extension. Next. So I think you people have understood what is uh, the first part of abacus, how we are doing it. Then uh, when we are using the formulas, we have started with small friend, small friend addition we have done, small friend subtraction we have done. Now next class when I come, what you have to do? I know you people have got a new book. right abacus new book you have got that book you will keep it on your table i suppose it will be 3a so far i remember it will be 3a uh, 1a 1a 1b 2a 2b then 3a 3b 4a okay 5a you will get 5a right then you open that a book not b book i don't need that b book from a book i will explain you what is the process after my explanation i will give you homework because we cannot meet now so once i meet i will see your book and copies whatever it is but now as of now at home you will do a book only not b book okay so i will tell you how to do how to prepare answers and all what is the formula in the next class we will do the sum so all be prepared in the next class we are going to do big friend formula this is a touch up for you next class i will explain everything that means small friend i know how to add up and how to subtract now my big friend formula will come where my sums will be more easier to calculate okay so till then bye bye take care have a blessed day